Hi, it's Jim from Animal Ability. Today I'm going to show you cable crossover flies, with the first being the standard cable fly, very reminiscent of the most muscular pose in bodybuilding. Works your whole chest, especially the lower. And then here we go with a cable upper chest fly standing. You want to stagger your stance. You can shift in the middle or between sets is usually better. Slight bend in the elbows. And here we go with a standing straight fly. This works your full chest, upper and lower, just like a flat bench or a standard flat bench fly. And here we are doing a flat bench cable fly. So this works the full chest. Getting a good stretch at the bottom, keeping the bend in the elbows, trying not to overstretch the shoulder joint. And here we go with the incline setting. A little more upper chest on this. And here's the decline for the lower chest. Still working your full chest muscle, but you're emphasizing different areas with the angle of the bench or the stance. And here we are upright. This is similar to a flat except you're facing forward and the resistance is directly out from the shoulders. Really squeezing in the middle and here we go with a single arm fly. You want to grab it and you could actually work up to where you're using a significant amount of weight on here and you can cross over past the middle to get the full contraction. And then here we go with a prone chest opener. You usually want to do this after your uh, chest work. You can do it anytime but mainly it really works your stretching out your pec minor after chest work. You can use blocks, flat or upright, or you can even use medicine balls. And you're fully supported.